Hello and welcome. Today I'm going to be showing you how to get your sneak skill to 100 very fast. So what you want to do is come to the Guardian Stones. It's just near Riverwood, Riverwood where you first start the game. And you're going to want to activate this stone on the left, the Thief Stone. That way it will give you 20% faster on your skills like uh, sneak, pickpocket and all stuff like that. And what I re recommend doing after this as well is coming we to a, an inn or something like that or a bed that you Time. own. Sure thing. Sleep sure in your bed. Day. You can see here I've come to the the end to I'll get into the bed. Right this Rented way. a bed. He's gonna come in, open the door for us. You can do this at any inn. So sleep in the bed. Once you wake up, you'll have this well rested bonus. So it's another ten percent for eight hours on your skills. Then what you want to do is you're gonna to want to come up to where the greybeards live, high hoff for up. Off ground or something like that, I say. Once here, you run up, come through the door, and then you're going to look for uh, an unsuspecting grey beard. They uh, can be in a number of areas in here, as you're going to see. Normally, they're either to your left here, which in my case, in this run, they, was, they wasn't here. So I had to run all the way back to the right hand side, and uh, they normally be praying. I find this is the best, best time to do it when they're praying. So then what you're going to want to do is run up behind them, get into sneak mode and then what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to change your difficulty to legendary status so it takes them longer to kill, you can see through the settings up to legendary, sneaking and then you can uh, hack at them but make sure you, you're not detected when, uh, when you're doing this. I'll show you in a moment what happens if you actually do get detected. So I recommend when you're doing this to save sort of every five levels or so, just to make sure that you don't mess it up. Lucky enough, one comes back here. As you can see how quick it's going up as well. If the health gets a little bit too low, you can uh, just wait for an hour and then you can carry on. At the moment, because I'm such a low level, it doesn't really affect it. So I'm going to show you now what happens if you get it wrong and you get your timing wrong. So this is going all normal. And then I hit him when he's detected. And then what happens? They attack. And then you've messed it up. What I do recommend is uh, just putting a few skill points into this skill tree just so your sneak attacks can now do six times damage because the more damage that you're putting out on this the, the quicker your uh, sneak rate will go up as you can see I've done it a few times so I'm up to six three and also if you put points into one hand as well that will also uh, help the time there it goes up see armsman another sixty percent damage so it's definitely worth doing you can do this with a lot of skills this will also increase your uh, one-handed skills whilst doing this as well you can also do it with a bow if you want to do your archery. Just always make sure that it goes back to hidden before you start swiping at them. As you can see, I just keep saving all the way through. Because you don't want to do loads and then uh, mess it up. If you did find this video helpful in any way, smash that like button for me. And subscribe for more Skyrim tutorials. Let me know down in the comments how long it took you to get to your 100 sneak skill. I know for me, I did this and it took about 20 minutes. So it's, it's well worth doing. So I'm going to leave you with the rest of this and I will see you in the next video. I'm out.